What's going on everyone? So today we're taking a look at the Tack Life Laser Distance Measure. So Tack Light actually has a lot of different tools out on the market and this just happens to be one of them. Well, what's really nice about these distance measures is that they're really versatile and you know you can use these for if you're measuring long distances where you can't use a tape measure. Now we've done other laser measures before on this channel and I have to say this one here actually feels a lot more solid than the previous ones that we've done. It just feels a little bit more heavy duty and really rugged actually. It's a really thick polycarbon plastic on here and uh, so right out of the box I'm, I'm pretty impressed with the build. I don't know how it works um, but so far the build quality feels pretty good on this. So a couple other things you'll get in this package here. You'll get the instructions. You're gonna get a nice little carrying case here. You can put that in there and you get a little strap. The other cool thing you'll get here is it's actually a little handheld reflective card that if you have somebody standing down at a distance you can actually shine that laser right on that and it'll give you the reading back so that's pretty cool and just a uh, warranty card and a thank you so you would send this in I believe and it'll tell you um, how to do that right here alright so let's hit the uh, read button turn this unit on and right there you can see that you have a bunch of different readings we'll go through each one of these here but um, a lot of different things you can do on this meter here so it's not just a single read you can actually store different uh, measurements and you can switch them up with different units and all that good stuff but let's uh, let's take a look at that all right so let's look at the different units here uh, all you have to do is hit this little button and kind of hold it in right now we have meters here and uh, we're in the US so we're not going to use meters and uh, we're going to go we're just going to hit that here it's a unit so we can go straight inches if we wanted to so if I wanted to read this now what I would do is I would come over here and I'm just gonna shine this right on my car I'll just hit read you can say that says eight and a half inches now if I want I can also hold that in we'll go to feet and inches have just feet and then back to meter so a lot of different readings you can take on this reader here now another thing that you want to look at is where am I actually measuring this at from on the unit itself a lot of them will start on the back of the unit where the measurement actually begins some will start on the front this one here you can actually change just by hitting this button here so instead of going from the back of the unit we can actually go right here in the front where we can bring it down towards the middle and then once again just by hitting it go down towards the end so that's pretty cool right there it's just an extra little feature on that so I like that all right so now you can do a live read on this or you can actually keep the measurements that you just took so if I were to go read right here we're gonna shine that right up on the card here and now you can see there's really nothing on there but if I were to hold that and now push that button again, you can see that I have 10.4 inches. Now what's really cool about this is I can actually hit this again and hit that button. Now I got 12.5 inches and you can have four of those programmed into that unit. Area, volume, and measuring. All right here from this little button. You can see it all up here. So very cool. So if you really need to get in depth with all of your stuff here, just hit this button. You can see how it changes up. Everything you need to do, see it right up on top how it changes. So that is very cool. So over here you also have your addition and subtraction from your measurements. You can see how much battery life you actually have right up here. And what's nice about this is it only takes three AAA batteries, so it doesn't take a lot to operate this thing. And you also have a save mode, so that is pretty cool. Now, at the end of the day, I have to say, this thing is pretty versatile. It's a lot more advanced than some of the other meters that we use on this channel. 
And with that being said, the only downside that I found on this entire unit was sometimes it's a pain in the butt to change the units. If I hit this button, you can see that it didn't change. So sometimes you actually got to hold it, hit it in twice. There you go. You see it change. But what I would like to see is it actually change when I'm hitting that button and it's not doing that. So I got to play with it every once in a while. And that's a little bit of a negative factor for me on this. Now for the measurements themselves, this thing actually takes really good measurements and I made sure I double check with tape measures and some of the other distance measures that I had and everything was really spot on with this. So I'm very pleased with that and I really like the, the feel of this thing, the, the rugged durability of it feels great but I really wish that this unit button here, as you can see once again, it's a little bit flawed I would say. You just really got to hold that in, sometimes you got to hit it twice. I'm not really excited about that. But that being said, I like this unit. I think it's good. I'll put a link to it in the description. If this review has helped, please thumbs up, subscribe. Check us out at www.tourreviewzone.com and we will be back with more videos soon.